G'day fellow collectors, Sci-Fi back again with another action figure review. Something that I did not, I totally forgot about. Hey, my uh, good friend Jason, middle-aged Kiwi man collecting Star Wars figures, has given me a gift. So anyone who is following me on Instagram, and I said I've got a package and it's got lots of custom figures, super expensive and really cool. Wrong package. That's coming <clears throat> soon, I hope. That's another story altogether. Good grief, it spent me all morning trying to track that thing down. But anyway, that's another story. So here we are. Jason, thank you very much, man. Um, I just dropped a comment because he was doing some, I think, some army building videos or whatever. And I mentioned that, oh, I can't, you can't find this thing in Australia anywhere. And I'm serious. Where I live in Australia, I cannot find this thing anywhere. <clears throat> anywhere. The only one I can find is the Navarro. Sorry, the, the um the Boba Fett one with the the Stormtrooper helmets and that. Whatever. If you need that one, I've there's plenty around here where I live. I'll get you one. Because I have your address. No, just kidding. I just I do, I have your address. So yeah, so it came to me and just went. At first, yeah, again, I'd never looked at the back of the box, and I just went, oh, cool, here's my custom figures. Then I saw the notes, and went, boom, Kiara Sci-Fi, and I thought, hang on a minute, that's not my custom guy. He's not from across the ditch, he's from the United States. So there we go, dear Kiara Sci-Fi, I hope you are well. Mate, I know you were after one of these bad boys, and they are too good to miss out on. I enjoy watching your channel. And thank you for watching mine. All the best, and may the force be with you. Jason, middle-aged Kiwi man, Star Wars. He's... That is cool. Yeah, man. And also, yeah, I swear, I, I love your videos too, man. You've got an awesome setup. And if you don't know who he is, he will leave a comment down below. So I can't link. I don't know how to hell to link around here. He'll leave a comment down below. Click on his, on his icon, and boom, you're in his channel. Subscribe and all that. And also got some stickers. Wow. Very cool. That's his that's his icon. I don't know what to do with them. Yeah, <laughs> we'll see. I've got a few items from like Kessel Run Hair, Sci-Fi Collectibles, so on and so on. I still don't know what to do with them. Yeah. But yeah, I don't know if I'd do anything like that myself. Um, yeah. I don't know. Anyway, so this is what he sent me, because there's nothing, I don't know, where are you, if you're in Australia, have you seen these on the pegs, have you seen them anywhere, I, for the life of me, have not, um, yeah, I don't know what they cost these days as well, because the, the last two pack deluxe set in these boxes cost me $60, and Jason, if you haven't got your, <coughs> um, uh, Dark Trooper yet, I think there might be one or two floating around on, on the pegs. I will get you one. Um, but yeah, it's in 60 bucks and they're sort of hidden. I think some guys actually put money aside and thrown it up in a, in one of the... You know how you do the old trick, you know, you put something hidden in the bins and stuff. Yeah, I think someone's done that because I found it and I don't need it. But if you want one, I'll get you one. Just let me know. Um, so yeah, there we go. I'm not going to do a whole review on it, but I'm just saying thank you. Thank you so much. And there we go. All right, and there it is. I'm going to not... I'll move this first, because yeah, it's great. Excellent for my Mandalorian display. Um, it's not all set up properly. I've only just put it, pulled it apart. We're looking at it together. But it looks fantastic. I will eventually fix up the Stormtrooper to... I oh, know it was very hard because one thing I found really weird was he's, he's still got the trigger finger and it was very hard to wrap it around the web cannon um, holster, you know, the whatever, yeah. And I've kept the firing display there, looks good. Yeah, so cool, there we are. Thank you so much, man. I know I'm not going to do a full review, it wasn't too hard to get together and sort of move that around once I yeah so if these things do appear in Australia let me know I mean I've never seen one but again thank you so much so much Jason that is so cool I'd love to return the favour again I have your address 
it's all good. So yeah, it's been ups and downs today in the collecting world for me, you know. Trying to track down my <coughs> custom figures and they're supposedly either in Jamaica or Belgium or just down the road at some bloody uh, earth moving, moving equipment in Jerobomba, which is not far away from me. I, I could not track this thing to begin with. Uh, I will talk to my custom collector again. He's very into it and very making sure and proactive to make sure I get my stuff. Yeah, it's worth a few bucks, but still. Again, ups and downs. So yeah, very cool. Thank you so much, Jason. Honestly, I cannot... Yeah, it's going to look great in the collection. Great in the display. And again, speaking of ups and downs, I also got another phone call. So there we go. Jace, thanks very much, mate. Again, if, if I can find one of those Dark Trooper packs, I'll um, get you one and send it on your way. <clears throat> All right, speaking of ups and downs, I got another up. I just got a phone call not long ago um, from Zing. They said, we've got something for you. You've been talking about it and blabbing about it and asking for it. I said, you got it? And they said, yes. So I'm going to dust myself off a bit and go for a trip down the shops, down the mall, where this place is in Zing. And yeah, the gloves are on for this case. For this one, this next figure I'm going to review. If you know what I mean, you probably do. All right, guys, all the best. Jason, again, thank you so much. Subscribe to his channel and sci-fi out. And the force is with you. This is the way.